Hey guys, and welcome back to S Zone. My name is Sven, and my Twitch gamer ID is Very Soft Hands. And today I'm using the magnetic grip device, the MGD, with anomalies. Here's an anomaly. In the center, we have artifact pillow. There's another guy around here, and I hope he's not going to take it while I'm busy doing it. Okay, you need some batteries, 9 volts, and a magnetic grip. I'm going to use it. it. Uses some power right off the bat to turn it on. Right here is the anomaly. Here's the range. You're not allowed to turn like this and stick the oh, sorry, artifact. This round circle is an artifact. You cannot pick up the artifact like this. You must face it or sideways or behind you. You cannot pick it up. see if we can click on this. That looks clickable. So what you do, you click on this, there's going to be some numbers pop up. You must type the numbers in the order and it could be arrow keys, the old game arrow keys. So let's give it a shot here. And you have to type it when this pointer points down in the box. It will scroll across. So it'll scroll across. You have to hit that number before it leaves the box. The scroller will hit that box. Then you hit that number and so on and so forth. So first you click on this like I'm about to do. Then get your hands ready to start typing. Six, two, three, seven, six. Boom. Look at this, you collected. Let me back up first. Oh dear, I'm too heavy. Shoot. Get rid of it. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> All right. You collected the pillow artifact, and here it is. Boom. There you have it, everyone. Approximate cost, 14,000 rubles. So you could probably sell it at a clan base for, I don't know, 10, 12,000. Its effect while carrying it is negative 10 against bullet damage. I don't do PvP, really, at the moment, so that's all right. There you have it. I uh, closed out the magnetic grip device. You, sh you shouldn't press escape to close out all your all your menus here because uh, that uses up the power. You can leave it open and just click the close button on your inventory and then run over to the next uh, anomaly to pick up an artifact, leaving it open. That way you won't have to power it every single time. You want to it turns on. You just can leave it on running while you're running around. So there you have it. I've used the magnetic grip device. Uh, Rewatch that video a few times. And that's how you retrieve artifacts. You purchase this. Here, here's a good tip. Where to purchase this? You get it from some quests, but if you ever lose it or just something, it does fall out of your bag. Here's the Lubbock Forest Land map. I wish we could make this full screen. And here is Gourmet Village Stadium. And uh, here in M11, H, M12, and H12, this area is where you, you can purchase the magnetic grip device and the 9 volt batteries. Most repairmen have 9 volt batteries. We can only purchase the 15 kilogram. That's right, 15 kilogram magnetic grip device from this area here. It is purchased from the guy that is in the booth. Go to the guy in the booth on the south end of this compound and he'll sell to you. It's only, uh, I think it's less than 2,000 rubles. I think it's like 1,100 or 1,200 rubles. Really cheap. It's super heavy. Take a look here. takes five power out of your volts here, but it's 15 kilograms. There is, however, a lighter version that is five kilograms, but it does not cost 1,000 rubles approximately. It's around 1,100 or 1,200. It actually costs f closer to 50,000 rubles, but it only weighs five kilograms. And another plus to that particular one that's 50,000 rubles is it cannot be taken off your person 
if you were killed PvP. It does drop in your loot bag on the ground if you respawn <laughs> at a fire pit. But it, I've read on the internet that it, uh, yeah, it can't be taken f from a PvP player. So there you have it, guys. Getting random artifacts from anomalies. Let's just go over here and see if there's another one. On my computer, they don't actually pop, <laughs> pop up until I get closer to them. They take a couple seconds to generate the picture. <laughs> this is a great way to make money. It's probably the best way in the game to make money. But I'm only level 11. I don't know everything. I'll check one more, and then uh, that'll be the end of this video. Hope that was helpful. I did explain it fairly quickly. There was a guy that was around. He seems to be gone now. I think he was checking them as well. Have a good one, guys. And uh, actually, yeah, I'm going to make another video right now about that bear. See you later.